folks, this is Fred Bernardo, the smoking guitar player from Tasty Licks Barbecue Supply in beautiful downtown Shillington, Pennsylvania. And this is a big green egg. And this is a Kamado Joe cooker. And today, we're making pizza. Really good pizza. Let's go! on the Kamado Joe Grill. I got my dough stretched out here. Let's give it a little more stretch, a little more stretch, and a little toss. And we're gonna put some sauce and some cheese and stuff on here. So camera, camera lady, if you wanna get a little close up here. We're not gonna spend too much time on this part because we just wanna show you how it bakes in the Kamado Joe. The Kamado Joe classic. Okay, a little sauce, All right? A little more maybe, not too much. Almost too much is just right on that, okay? Now, we're gonna put some mozzarella, some fresh maz on here. Maybe about five, six ounces. We have our super ceramic baking stone on our Kamado Joe with our riser blocks, and we're all ready to go. Now over here, let me just get it, camera person, hang on, here comes the fresh basil. Put some of this on here, maznagol. Basil, basil, whatever language you want to speak. Put some olive oil, you go like this, like a six, sort of. A little swirly. And then a little bit of tree hugger, rub on there. We'll do it like this here. We'll put it in my palm. And we'll put just a pinch on there like this here. Okay, she's ready to go. Now I'm going to scoop her up and take her out there and put her on my grill. So watch close, don't blink. Don't blink. There she is. Ooh, don't get it all center there, boys. That one piece of cheese is trying to escape. Okay, there we go. Let's go out there and get it on our grill. Okay, so we've got 630 degrees there. And here's our setup with our riser box, our Kamado Joe deflector, and our super baking stone. And that's it. 429 degrees. I would like it a little hotter. This is our first pie of the day. I'm going to do this to push any ash away. There she goes. It's going to take about three minutes to bake that. Okay, so it's been about a minute. Our pie's in the Kamado Joe. Now, I'll let you know, I opened up the top here a little bit, and I'm already up to seven and a quarter, so I'm going to close it back down a little. But let's see how our pie's doing in here, camera girl. Oh, look at that. Looking good. Now don't dig in there until you're sure it's got a skin on the bottom. Don't leave your lid open too much, okay? Because you want the top to really cook the top. So we're gonna come back in another minute or two and check it. Okay, so it's been about maybe two, two and a half minutes. Let's see how she's doing. There's our Kamado Joe. We got our pie in here. Camera person. Oh yeah, look at that. The moz is it's starting to get a little golden on the top. Now this is our first one, and the stone wasn't real hot. This one might take a little longer. Move it around a little, and we'll let her rock for another minute or two, and then we'll put a second one in and we'll see how that one does. Okay, we're at two minutes on our pizza in the Kamado Joe. Two minutes. We're almost 700 degrees now. I opened the top up. Oh, man, she's looking beautiful. Starting to get melted on the top. This is our first one, so it might not get too brown on the bottom. It's starting to look pretty good. That's two minutes. Let's give it another minute or two to see what happens. It's in about three and a half minutes, maybe three and three quarters, something like that. Okay, we got our pizza in our Kamado Joe right here. And let's see what she looks like. Oh, take a look at that camera person. That is a little hard to beat. Now we don't have too much jar on our crust. We're gonna give it another minute maybe. Only because we're trying to get it a little darker, but it's pretty well baked. We'll see what happens. Okay, we're at four minutes. We're at 725 degrees because I opened the top up and let it breathe a little more. And I, I just gotta have this pizza, so let's see how it looks. Ho oh, ho! Look at that, ladies and gentlemen, and Kamado Joe fans. Oh, the bottom is perfect. Okay? 
Now you see that cheese squiggling. I like it when it's a little brown like that. That's why we fan it a little, but this is crunchy. Okay, we're gonna go inside and eat. Okay, folks, this is our pizza. I want you to hear the crackle of this crust. Can you hear that? Oh, perfect. Okay, I'm gonna cut it up and eat it, and that's how pizza gets on the